Welcome to Mona Lisa Tarot, your monthly guide to self-awareness. Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. This is your message for August 2021. Let's get started with the reading. The first card is of the language of flower deck. And you got Camellia, peace, be calm, and calm will come. Aries, beginning of August, enjoy every day, a day at a time. If you require peace because you may feel pressured or out of breath, step aside, go in the garden and smell the flowers. This one deep breath you take when you smell the fragrant flower gives you peace and calm. You can always go back to the calming sensation in your thoughts the moment stress comes up. Picture this camellia and know peace is yours. The next card is of the Surrender deck and you got Surrender Negative Thinking. Here is negative thoughts only then are limiting if you don't release them. At their arrival ask, why are you here? And listen for the answer in silence. The word or words that come to your mind are the answer. And you can say then, I release you. And if they come back, you will release them again until you're free of that thought or that other thought. The next card is Envy. Here is somebody in your household is envious of you. Here we see the strong contrast of burden versus light. Some of you feel they would like to leave this household or would like to work outside the home where you can feel the light and feel also light in comparison to burden. You will feel light around your heart if you're not home. A decision is upon you to make, Aries. The next card is Courage. Aries, find the courage to remove yourself from limitations this month. This card confirms you are a courageous person, you're focused on one thing this month, an opportunity you have been waiting for, one that will elevate you, one that will create an explosion of energy in your favor. The next card is Justice. 
justice can simply mean here that you start recognizing the right path for yourself. The moment you open this door, you feel peace and calm. You feel positive about yourself stepping into the world. The negative thinking you surrender when you leave this home, even if it is only for the work day. And here we see the number eight, eight hours, an eight hour work day. While you're out, you gain more knowledge of what is good for you, Aries. The next card is trust. You have a strong connection to your soul's loving voice and have faith in your intuition. Aries, you're definitely very intuitive people. Many of you are very spiritual and know how to connect with your higher self. On a soul level, you know who you are. You know you are divine. You know you are connected to the divine and to the earth at the same time. See this prominent energy above your head and below you? This month, Aries, you are letting go the last bit of negative thinking. With the 8-8 Lionsgate portal. The countdown is on as mankind's consciousness is moving up a level toward peace and calm for all. Many Aries will light the path as healers, coaches, and light workers. Others will trust you because they know that you have faith and intuition. The last card is by Daniela Port, Truth Bombs, and you got Having High Standards Works Wonders. High standards, be it in a relationship or at work for yourself and others, is what you desire. At least for you, Aries, you like to hold yourself accountable. You're very disciplined. You wish to succeed. You can be hard on yourself when you make a mistake. You downplay your successes, you overthink things a lot, you want to do better, you do more for others than for yourself, you push yourself to work as hard as you can, and you always have new things that you want to do or that you want to create. Assess whether that's currently working for you or not. If it is, continue what you're doing. If it is not, 
it's time to make changes. Aries, I hope you enjoyed this reading. Let me know at the bottom in the comment area what your thoughts are and please subscribe and like my videos. I see you again in September.